The only people who don't want to disclose the truth are people with something to hide. I challenge you. Somebody please give me something in the Constitution that gives them the authority to completely redefine society, culture, history, humanity, and marriage. Because that's all involved. And by the way, folks, think of the ramifications. Just a few months ago, if I were to tell you, you know what? I think we ought to start teaching little three- and four-year-olds in preschool that two men having sex is love. I think we ought to start teaching little little four- and five-year-old little girls that two women having sex together is love. And uh, it's a marriage. It's a family. You would have wanted to burn me at the stake. Well, you know what's getting ready to happen? See, a lot of people haven't even thought about this. Now the public school systems will not only teach your little children this, but it would be required. It's the law. And if you try to stand in the way of it, you can have all manner of federal mandates and laws against you, the full force of the federal government. And that's just one ramification. We're already teaching these precious little children that they come from monkeys and a cosmic accident, and they're nothing more than souped-up gorillas, and that you can reach in their womb and pull out a baby one day and throw it in a trash can if it's inconvenient. We're already teaching them that. Now we're going to teach them there's no such thing as marriage. It's just whatever you want it to be. And it's whoever you want it to be. And I'm telling you, folks, the radical homosexual movement, this is not the end of it for them. It's not like, okay, this is all we wanted, it's over. Oh, no. Oh, no. This is the platform from which they will dive into the pool, into the cesspool. You mark my words. There's going to be a display of decadence in this nation that you have never seen before. Watch what Hollywood does. Watch what the media does as they shift to the political correctness. Watch what Fox News does. Watch. Don't call me crazy. You called me crazy about global warming and you got burnt. You called me crazy about saying this day was coming and you got burnt. You called me crazy when I said this man in the White House probably isn't even from here. And you've been burned and going to be burned on that. Don't call me crazy about this. You've just seen the door opened. We've spit in the face of God, folks. In the meantime, this doesn't change our message or our mission at all for those of us that are believers. Never grow weary of doing good. Be the salt, be the light. For such a time as this, we have been raised up. No, it's not all falling apart. It's all coming together. The only people who don't want to disclose the truth are people with something to hide.